In my last video, I showed you how to install Banalot Software Extender BLSE. Today, I show you how to install a reshade to Mod Organizer. First, we have to pick one. We take the real slim shader, head over to Files. Um, in this case, the uh, Manager Download button is missing. Uh, we can I can show you a little trick. If you uh, right click this button and uh, open it in a new tab, uh, we can add something to the URL. Um, in this case, uh, add nmm equals one. If you know, uh, hit the start download button, the download should appear in your um, download window. We can't install it uh, like this. Um, if we check uh, the BLSE uh, file structure, we have to match it. We have to add a root folder, a bin folder, and a Win64 shipping client folder. We'll copy this one. <laughs> okay, we double click it for installation. Uh, we left click uh, modules, right click, create a new directory. First one is called root. Then we left click the root directory and create a new one. This one is the bin folder, and the same on the bin folder, we create a new directory, and I paste the Win64 shipping client uh, folder inside. Uh, now we can uh, drag and drop the Vanilla Plus test for any inside the Win64 shipping client folder. It uh, should look like this. Now we can uh, hit OK. Uh, we ignore the info text from Mod Organizer. That was the first step. Next one is uh, we open our browser again and go to uh, reshade.me. If you scroll down a little bit, you will find the download uh, reshade six point five zero. We before we install it, open our Steam folder. I have a shortcut here on my uh, taskbar. Go to Banalot's uh, Win64 shipping client folder. And we want to highlight all files inside. Like this. Now we can uh, install Reshade. We pick the banner lot uh, Excel, the first one is usually the right one. And hit uh, next. That's okay, we don't change anything here. Uh, same in this window, we don't uh, change anything. And the installation is complete. You will see those files are new. We Cut them from the Banalot uh, Win64 shipping client folder. And paste it into the real slim shader. We open it in an explorer. Root bin Win64. And we paste it inside here. And now we can uh, open the... Uh, preset uh, with a text editor in this case I pick um, notepad++ 
and we copy the text and go to the reshade preset any open it in editor and paste it inside and we save it that should be the installation of a reshade we can check it now in game Reshade 6.5 is uh, loaded. We can open the user interface, go to settings. Uh, we can um, give the effect toggle key. In this case, I pick the uh, left arrow key. Close the window. And now we can uh, toggle it on and off. That's off, that's on. I hope you see the difference. That's on, that's off. Okay guys, uh, that's the installation of reshades. You can have uh, multiple reshades installed and uh, choose one. A little bonus um, we right click the top on top and we hide the flags and uh, maybe uh, categories it's a little bit cleaner okay guys that's for today